All right, folks, this is a short video, but you guys are going to like this. This cop is trying to get a false confession out of this man. Have you guys ever heard the term blame shifting? Well, that's exactly what this cop here is doing. Sometimes cops have itchy trigger fingers. They shoot and kill people when they're not supposed to, but they always try to justify it. In this video, you're going to hear the wording that they use to justify some of those shootings. And the guy that's being interviewed calls him out on it. Outstanding. You guys check out this quick clip. I'll see you at the end. I think you were a stone cold killer. I don't. Like, if you accidentally shot the dude because you flinched or you got scared because of something he did, now is the time. If you come up with that stuff later, nobody is going to believe a word you say. How the f would somebody accidentally shoot somebody? Because if your finger's on the trigger, it's called a sympathetic reflex. It happens to police officers all the time. I think that's a term that's been come up with just to cover their asses for shooting people. Well, you can try to make it about that. I'm talking about you. I wouldn't know. Never shot anybody. Cops do this all the time, folks. When you do something, they try to secure a conviction and they throw the book at you. When cops do the exact same thing, they try to call it something else. They use wordplay and umbrellas of protection, so we hardly ever get to see any accountability or transparency. This cop was trying to get a false confession out of the man, but in reality, it looks like the man got a confession out of the cop. Because now we know the wording that they're going to use on the next OIS, Officer Involved Shooting. I'm telling you folks, this is why these channels are important. Police accountability videos are possibly the most important videos on the internet today. We get to learn from them. You think this cop cares whether this man really killed somebody or not? Hell no, he wants a conviction. We've heard far too many stories of cops trying to secure a conviction by getting false confessions. I think cops should be locked up when they do that. Anyhow, it was just a short clip I wanted to show you guys. I wanted to point to and highlight exactly what the cop did and said and the wording that they used to basically get away with murder. All right, folks, thank you for watching. We'll see you on the next one. Peace.